these are my favorite coins and rounds and when we come back I'll let you know why. Winning Image Photography here. And Silver Steeler. And I saw that everybody was doing these lists of showing their favorite coins and I thought I would show you mine. So I don't have favorites and less favorites. I have a lot of favorites. I'm going to get started with this and this. I love this one. And this one. Who's it from? These were sent to me from Value Hunter. And I had done the opening for his history coins and he paid me in silver and I told him to keep the silver and give it to Tomoko Enterprises for the auction. And he sent me these anyway and put the ones in the auction. And I thought that was, just, well, it was a surprise anyway. I'm very generous on this. It is very generous. Mm -hmm. Because of the auction with Tomoko Enterprises, Sterling Cannabis was a big part of that. And I helped out as a mod and kept track of things. And so after that, he sent me these. Also, some of those were for some, I believe Morgan and Morgans I gave him one time too. So it was an overall exchange for an exchange. Your work, a little bit of silver from us, and gave those pieces. I believe the cross is mine, the heart's yours. We, yeah. can fight, we can fight about that later. No, I think the heart's mine. Okay. Well, you have a bigger heart than I do, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, so, and then... This one, another unbelievably generous person in the community. I had done his logo for him and he sent me the silver pieces that I had asked for. And then he said he had a surprise in there for me. And this was a surprise. It was really a surprise. I was shocked. Mm, looks like a one-tenth yeah. American gold eagle. Yeah, and it was from Vogus. Class act, Vogus. Thank you. Make sure you get a little bit more work out of her for that. I told them I would. Okay, so if, since we're doing the gold, this has a horse on it. It's a sovereign, and it was a gift for Christmas. Um, not last Christmas, but the Christmas before. Who's it a gift from? It was a gift from Silver <gasps> Steeler. Ooh, that would be I. And this princess coin was a gift from Silver Steeler this last Christmas. That's I again. That is you. Okay, so um, this is also a gift and it wasn't even my birthday or Christmas or anything, but I see my face. We'll have to edit that out. <laughs> he bought me the reverse proof. Well, I don't think this is really called a proof. 
This one's the proof. Mm -hmm. The Australian Brumby. Yes. It's beautiful. It's got horsies on it. I that's really, a two ounce one in the box. That's a two ounce, and these are two one ounce. Nice. And now you can't see what it looks like. And you're okay. welcome, you're welcome, you're welcome. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. And then this was a gift to me from Talking Bullion, who gave this one to Silver Steeler. And Mrs. Talking Bullion, too. Yes, Mr. and Mrs. Talking Bullion. And I really like Talking Bullion's round because it has his name on it and it sits right behind us. And it, it means a lot to have something that's personalized. And this is just beautiful. So, elemental metals, I believe. I know they're they're a defunct stamping company now, minting company. I know they're, they're no longer in existence. I just don't know if I'm pronouncing it right or not. This is Statue of Liberty. It's very beautiful. Two ouncer. This two ouncer, thick one. Mm -hmm. Wow. Well, here's another two ouncer. Ooh, you know I like the two ouncers. Oh, this one's mine. Ah. This one, which is really funny because it was gotten, it was given to me because it has a horse on it. And this Nova Caesarea is um, a coin that was a replica of New Jersey. And Silver Steeler was raised in New Jersey. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of cool that Steve Rice got this coin for me. Two birds, one stone. Had the horse on there and New Jersey. Yeah. And he also got me another horsey. And this one's intricate. It's very... Um, busy. Mm -hmm. Jefferson Davis on there. It's very busy. I really like it too. And there's my face again. <laughs> but that one's really pretty too. And there's a horsey on it. Okay, and my favorite one. Well, one of my favorite ones maybe second favorite one is Silver Steelers. Both of this and Talking Bullions were poured by Backyard Bullion and this one is yours. And it's round number one. Look at the other side. It's one. It's number one. So I'll turn it over. It'll be it looks one. like otherwise it'd be number one hundred. <laughs> and I know I haven't gotten many, as many of those out yet. I'll be going. Right? I'll be going to him for more of these rounds eventually. Yes, I mean the pour marks on here mm, are gorgeous. Mm -hmm. He does an amazing job. Mm -hmm. All right, this is my favorite coin, and this is gonna be weird, <laughs> but it's. A 1969 Kennedy half dollar. And growing up, my grandfather would give me, when I was younger, silver dollars. And I used to put them in this wooden barrel bank, a big barrel. It was, I don't know, it was, it was a pretty good size for a bank. And then later in life, he would give me the half dollars. And so this one, I managed to let him, he let me take home. 
So it's the only one out of that bank that I have because the rest of them were when my grandmother died, went to other family members somehow. So this one means a lot to me because it was from my grandfather. Nice. And we put a little piece of paper back here with the letter G in it to for grandpa. Also, so we can distinguish that coin from, well, other capsulated coins within this stack. So you gotta be able to, we don't wanna lose track of it, so. And 69 is the year I was born. So it's a little bit different than everybody else's favorite coins, but my favorite coins are the ones that I look at and they make me feel something. Well, why don't you close it out? There's a good top, there's a good top 10. You know, or there's, more. <laughs> there's no order to it, you <laughs> well, know, but it's, it's got a lot of sentimental value to it in all your pieces. And that's why these coins mean something to you. You know, none of these will ever be let go, exchanged or anything else, unless they offer us a bunch, a bunch of money, then we're letting them go. Yeah, so. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. Well, there's a lot gold. of gold we can't get rid of now. <laughs> well, maybe. The... It's most of our gold. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well. So, thank you for joining me, and I will catch you on the next video. This is uh, Winning Image Photography with Silver Steeler. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone.